Hey boys and girls, this book is called Snow Wonder, We're Friends, and it's by Hallmark, and it's a story from the Hallmark Holiday Series, written by Molly Wigand and illustrated by Mike Esberg. Snow Wonder, We're Friends. The week before Christmas, Brianna and Brendan were bouncing right off the walls. From morning till night, the kids giggled and played while their mom worked at decking the halls. Mom needed a break, so she sent the kids out with a warm and woolly hat on each noggin. They tromped through the snow to an old backyard shed and pulled out the family toboggan. Determined to have an exciting adventure, they headed for Daredevil Hill. They'd heard there was magic and mystery there, and they did love a wild winter thrill. As the kids looked straight down from the hill's scary summit, the feathery snow sparkled and swirled. This was no bunny slope, but they were both ready to sled into that magical world. This is awesome, cried Brendan. Hot dog, yelled Brianna. Look out below, everyone. Then they took a deep breath and zoomed down the hill. Wee! Brendan squealed. This is fun. The children went faster and faster and faster. Past the snow-covered pine trees, they sped. At this dizzying pace, they could hardly see straight. No one saw the big bump ahead. The toboggan went bam, then flew up in the air, but didn't crash back into the snow. It kept soaring upward, much higher and quicker than normal toboggan should go, over the rooftops and treetops. At super warp speed, the wind tossed the toboggan around. It swayed side to side. They did 12 loop-de-loops. Before landing, kerplunk on the ground, they brushed themselves off and began to explore. This looks uh, like town they were in. Check it out, Brendan said. That snow girl looks like you. And her snow brother could be my twin. The snow kids were running and jumping and playing and driving snow mom up the wall. So she sent them outside, like Brianna and Brendan, in their boots, hats, mittens, and all. From the moment they met, those four kids had a blast in spite of the blustering weather. After snow forts and snow pies, the friends all decided to make a new snow pile together. They rolled up some snowballs and packed them and stacked them till voila! They built a snow guy, and as soon as they gave him stick arms and a mouth, the coolest jokes started to fly. There were knock-knocks and limericks and silly snow songs, deck the halls with baloney, he said, jingle bells, Santa smells, cracking jokes, making faces. This comic was knocking them dead. Have a nice day. Snow wonder we're friends. No line was too silly or punny. Do you think it will rain, dear? He joked with a chuckle. There just was no end to the funny. Ha, ho, hee, ho. Soon it was time for the kids to go home. No one wanted the great day to end, but Brianna and Brendan got ready to leave, along with their little snow friend. <clears throat> they said their goodbyes, and with hugs all around, they wrapped up the little guy tight, the snow friends helped out with a one, two, three, push, and the toboggan sailed off out of sight. In less than an instant, Brianna and Brendan were home with a story to share of a magical land filled with frosty good fun and the snow folks who welcomed them there. It was so much fun. Can we go back someday? I miss our snow friends. It's good to be home. And still to this day, after many long winters, the snow guy, so funny and small, Reminds the whole family with laughter and friends that laughter and friends are the very best presents of all. 
If you've enjoyed this book or it has touched your life in some way, we would love to hear from you. Snow Wonder, we are friends. I hope you love this book.